What's up everyone? My name is Mark Plant and this is MPV Vlogs. Hey everyone, like I said, my name is Mark Plant and this is MPV Vlogs. Thanks for tuning in. I do appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button down on the bottom. Be able to see all the videos that I've done over the past over seven years now I've been doing this. If you're already a subscriber, you know I appreciate you guys. If you hit that bell icon right next to the subscribe button, you'll get a notification anytime I put up a new video just like this one. If you're using a mobile device, just make sure notifications are allowed or you won't get the notification. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think and here we go. <laughs> All right, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start a new series right now. And what I'm gonna do is some unboxing of cheap technology. Now, when I say cheap technology, I am talking about anything $25 and under that you can purchase. Uh, technology is ridiculous. I mean, you, you're looking, stuff can run up to hundreds of dollars. We all don't have that budget. So what I decided to do is to show off some of the cheap technology and let you know whether $5 is worth it for them. So what we're going to do is this first product, I, I came across it at five below, $5 for a pair of Polaroid Bluetooth earphones. So what we're going to do is we're going to open these up and see if they're worth the five bucks. All right. So what we have here are a set of Polaroid wireless headphones with mics. They're Bluetooth. They come with, or the feature is full HD stereo. They're adjustable. They have a microphone and padded construction. Inside the box are the wireless headphones and a micro USB charging cable. Okay, specs on this, it works on Bluetooth 5.0. Takes about two hours to charge and the playtime's only about three to four hours. So that's really not that good. <laughs> Input and output is five volts. Battery capacity is 200 milliamps, milliamp hours, I should say. Uh, the driver diameter is 40 millimeters. Sensitivity, independence 32 ohms, frequency response, 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz. So yeah, and it's got a 3.7 built-in non-removable rechargeable lithium, lithium ion battery. That I like because most, most tech that I'm seeing at this price point is AA batteries. So let's open this up and we'll see what's inside. Yeah, pretty standard packaging. Pull that out. What do we got in the box here? And some basic instructions here. Okay. Telling us how to use them. So, let's pull these out. Wow, they're already scuffed up. Look at that. I don't know whether the camera's picking that up. They're all scuffed there. The scratch there. These don't look like they were returned, so hopefully they work. So basically they just click out like that. There you go. And there's a charging cable. So let's see if this has any juice in it. So click, and there's no juice in it. So we're gonna have to charge these up before I can demonstrate them. All right, now if you've watched my videos, you know I have very shaky hands, so bear with me on this. I do apologize for it, but nothing I can do about it. Okay, so we will take this whopping about eight inch charging cable here. Okay. I'm assuming that the micro USB goes in here, right here.
Okay, so we've charged these up a little bit here. And so we're going to turn them on by pressing this button. And as you see now, it's blinking both red and blue. That means that it's trying to peer. So we're going to try peering this with my Mac. So let's try and set this up here. All right, so what I'm going to do right now is let's try them on. Make sure I have them on the right ears. Now I have a rather large head. So I don't see how the, oh, there they go. All right, so they adjust out a little bit. Let's see how they fit on my head. Not too bad. They're kind of small, but I run into that all the time whenever I buy any sorts of headgear, hats, or anything like that. So yeah, not perfect for my head, but what are we gonna do? So what I'm gonna do is let's turn them on. Okay, so right now we're recording the full screen. Let's see, I don't wanna install updates yet. So let's go here into my Bluetooth. See if it picks it up. There it is. It's picking it up right here. Let's connect them. And I got a bing, two bings, ding ding in here. So they've they're connected. So Let's see how they work. So what I'm going to do here. Oops. Of course the Microsoft one messes up. Let's go over here. Let's open up Google Chrome. We'll bring it in here. I'm going to open up YouTube. And let's go to my channel. Not too bad. Wow. Let's turn the volume down a little bit on them. Wow, these these are good. Let's see if the mic will pick them up. Not bad. Let's try to get some music here. Okay, let's check out, we'll check out the Hamilton soundtrack. We'll go to the beginning. Of course, it's gotta have a, it's gotta be an ad. All right, let's see how it sounds. Not bad. I mean, you gotta look, this is $5. I am not thrown away, ma. Shot. I am not thrown away, ma. Shot. And you won't just swing the country of young stuff. You know me and I'm not. Ah, uh, you can't beat it. All right, everyone. I'm impressed. Uh, the Polaroid. Uh, I don't have a model number or anything on them. Uh, but I got them five below, five bucks. Bluetooth headset, it's supposed to have a mic in it. Uh, I didn't even check to see if that works. What do you say we hold for a second and I'm gonna go back over to the Mac. I'm gonna use the Mac camera and see whether it pulls it in. All right, everyone, I'm using the Mac camera here. Um, filming from the Mac, this should be pulling in the audio from this headset. I'm not expecting much with this. Uh, the sound is a lot better than I thought that it would be, but the mic is just a tiny hole over on the side here. So not really expecting too much for quality on the sound from this, but we'll see. Uh, so yeah, let's see uh, how it is. All right, everyone. What I did was 
I listened back to it and yeah, the sound isn't that good. Uh, not from the microphone anyway. If you want to get good sound, you're going to want to get a, a condenser mic like this and you'll get much better sound. What do you expect? They're, they're five bucks. I mean, you can't go wrong for five bucks. So I would recommend these. For five bucks, I would recommend them. All right, everyone. Polaroid $5 bluetooth headset from five below uh, yeah i'm impressed i mean they're not beats they're not any high end uh, you, yeah but you'll spend a heck of a lot of money for those five dollars so i yeah i'm i'm impressed with them i'm happy so that's going to be it for this video first piece of cheap tech that's a winner. I say yes. So I'm ending the video here. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, like I said, please hit that subscribe button down on the bottom. If you're already a subscriber, you know I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Please hit that bell icon. You get a notification anytime I put up a new video. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Let me know any cheap tech that you would like me to do a review on. Send it in to me and I'll do my best to do something on it. Thanks for coming and watching the whole video. Really helps with my, my rankings on YouTube. I appreciate it. Thank you so much, everyone. I'll be back to you guys again with some more cheap technology.